characters. This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. What's going on, everyone? This is Jacob Shoup. You're watching the 4 p.m. stock market update right here on Tiger Financial News Network. If you missed the show last hour, I was joined by Basil Chapman and Tim Ord. If you want to kind of either kind of recap that or if you didn't see it, go to our YouTube channel, Tiger Financial News Network. Our producer is hard at work. is going to have those clips up for you. Please consider giving them a like and our channel a subscribe as it helps us all out immensely. Of course, we have these two fantastic webinars from Tim Ord, uh, along with Basil's newsletter. And I want to say as well, this Friday, we are going to have another installment of live trading with Larry Pesavento. Now, this subscription is good for two sessions entirely. I get that question a little bit. Um, yes, when you get the subscription, it is good for two. So say you buy it uh, for, for this uh, Friday here, even though that is the fourth Friday of the month, you can also go to the one that occurs on the second of the next month in December. When you do that, make sure you really make sure you get in here because we have Larry Nove 24. You're going to use that code at checkout. That is going to save you $50 on your first uh, month subscription. It is a fantastic deal. Let's see what we got going on right now. The deposit finishing up 1.04% at 18,987. The Dow Jones Industrial off about 0.28% at 43,268. And you have the SPY up about 0.41% at 590, that E-mini trading up 0.37% at 5,942. Dollar finishing a little bit higher than when we opened at 3 p.m., but that is all right. Still trading somewhat low away from the 107, trading at 106.21. You can see really tried earlier today. I love that I can't see that. 106.67 and we're finishing uh, much lower beyond that. I was talking a little bit about Rheinmetall uh, before we went to the break, I want to just give you an example of what these guys are seeing, and it's really interesting. <laughs> Honestly, this might be good uh, for Germany in some capacity to have such a massive growth uh, in this kind of sector, especially since they've been kind of stalling out a little bit. Uh, but they're expecting in 2027 18% uh, operating margin and a cash conversion rate of more than 40%. Expansion into the U.S., core priority for the group. Be interesting to see what happens with Ryan Mattal. Folks, thank you so much for joining me. We'll be joined uh, tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. by Tommy O'Brien in the morning market kickoff, followed by Basil Chapman at 10, Steve Rhodes at 11, Larry Pesavento at 1, and then yours truly at 3. See you then.